Welcome back, everyone. This vlog is a collection of days in Miami. We got back from our Boston trip. We're getting out on the boat again and visiting our favorite sushi chef. There really isn't a lot of rhyme or reason to this vlog. It's really just a collection of moments in my life that I shot in February with some idea as to making a video about. The month of February got really busy towards the end and creating videos really took a back seat, but I wanted to put something together with what I had and this is the result. Oh, it's right out here. It's February and we haven't been out on the boat in about a month. Really looking forward to this weather here today. Yesterday I went and got my nails done and they did a fantastic job. Oh, and my toes too. I'll show you those later. But ready to go out on the boat again. The month of January has been a little chilly, but today it is over 80 degrees, some slight wind um, here and there, as, as you're noticing now, the, <laughs> the hair situation. Um, I did remember to bring, to put my windscreen on my microphone and I can see that it is receiving. Good things to check if you're a new YouTuber because it's not always the case. We're just really excited to get out on the boat again today. Enjoy the beautiful, warm, sunny weather of February in Miami. Let's go. We have to get the cooler ready and we are getting drinks for everyone who's coming with us. All the stuff you see behind me here on our table, that's for Love Fern, which I'll tell you more about that later. You can always tell when someone has recently gotten their nails done and they feel really good about it because they like, like to do these gestures with their hands. Oh, here people, here's my, here's this over there. That is my bag for Love Fern. There's Steven, see over there. We're gonna make a Negroni, and obviously you need. Wait, what is this? Dry, dry vermouth. I think you need sweet vermouth. We're gonna do it with dry vermouth this time. And I know that a Negroni requires Campari, but we have Aperol, so we only have, to my knowledge, one of the ingredients necessary. This is sparkling. Yeah. So. I'm gonna let Brittany make her Negroni <laughs> first and let her know, let me know how it goes. Thank you. 
we spent uh, the morning cleaning our patio deck chairs. This is gonna be loud. Where'd you go? Okay. Canceled the boat tomorrow. It's been cold. So, it's a cold-ish day here in Miami. <laughs> cold-ish because the rest of the United States is at a much cooler temperature than it is here today, but it is 72 degrees here today. I know you love getting these weather updates from me, so you're welcome. <laughs> we are about to go to Momi Market. Uh, in traditional Japanese culture, um, you take a month off every year. I don't really know why, but it's traditional for them to take a month off and close the business entirely and everybody gets that time to kind of refresh and recenter themselves. And so Mumi Market has been closed for all of January and they have reopened now that it's February and we are going to go visit them today. And we have a very special reason to visit them today because February is also a month that has a certain event in it that we're really looking forward to and that event is Love Burn. Part of that well, we're planning our camp theme, and our camp theme includes sushi. And we think that our favorite chef at Mumu Market will have some important details to tell us about how to make a great sushi platter at our Love Burn camp. So that is what we're just about to head off to do.